What's going on guys, it's Tyler from Service. I got Rachel Casey in the background, Hi. supervising. Um, so today's video is gonna be about um, desktop computers. Um, so this one we have is not displaying. So I'm gonna show you guys how to reseat the RAM today. And usually this will help um, if the computer gets juggled around or um, if somebody's been inside the computer messing with the RAM sticks. If they're not seated properly, um, you will not get any display. So we're just gonna turn this on real quick. You know, everything else seems to be working correctly inside, <clears throat> but we're getting no display. Um, no signal to, um, this one's hooked up to a TV for an example, but um, no video to the monitor or anything. So I will show you guys what to do step by step. So let's get into it. All right guys, so the first thing we wanna do is actually make sure um, that there's no power, okay? Um, go ahead and hook all your cords, um, your HDMI, your power, um, any USB ports or anything like that, unplug it. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna lay the desktop on its side, like this. All right, so once we get on our side, um, we can go ahead and just open up the panel here. Um, some models might have the four thumb screws. Um, basically, you'll just remove those thumb screws and then take the side glass off. So uh, I wanna give a teaching moment here. So the RAM inside of a desktop computer is usually right next to the big processor fan right here. Um, and it's this guy right here, okay? Um, usually there'll be one or two or there might be more depending on the model, um, but this unit only has one stick of RAM, okay? So the biggest thing that's important is that um, the RAM is actually seated all the way down. Um, and the best way to know that <coughs> is you see the little clips down here, um, right here, and there's one up top as well. So if this RAM stick wasn't seated properly, this clip would be down, like so. Now, there might be other times where the RAM is actually seated all the way, but you're still not getting any display. So that requires a reseat. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. So what you need to do is just make sure you press down the clips um, at the top and on the bottom. So basically they're open and then this stick will pull out just like this. All right, once you get your RAM stick out, um, you wanna make sure you hold it in um, the same orientation you pulled it out in. So if it came out like this, um, this is the way it's gonna go back in, okay? Um, so if it's in this port right here, you can move it to any port. Um, it doesn't really matter. Um, but if, you know, if obviously you're not getting any display in this port, um, you might wanna try this one. So um, basically you're just gonna put this RAM stick um, right down in the notches here. So you see, you put the corner down here and a corner down there. And then it kinda just sits here, okay? And it's kinda wiggly. So what you need to do is you need to press down on the top and you should hear a click like that. And then down here on the bottom, and so you hear a click. As you saw, um, these bottom clips clipped up to the um, stationary position, which both ends should be. All right, so now we just shut the door and now we're gonna go ahead and set this thing right back up and uh, get it hooked up to some power and see if we get any displays. Right, so we got our power hooked up and now we're gonna connect our HDMI cable. Um, it's important to make sure the computer is off when you do this. So we're gonna plug it into the graphics card port on the bottom here. And we'll plug it in, make sure it's in there. And then uh, we'll turn it on and see if we get any display. We'll give it a second here. Usually this TV will let us know um, if we're getting any display. Do, 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 do. Come on. Come on. There we go. Awesome, so we got a signal um, to the computer. It's a good sign. And then boom, there's the Windows logo. Uh, we'll grab the remote here, hit the back button, and uh, yeah, so that's an easy fix. Um, if you ever have a desktop gaming computer that's not displaying, uh, try to reseat the RAM. Um, it's important to uh, make sure that you uh, press the RAM down in the slot um, all the way, and if you have any questions at all, don't be afraid to reach out to me, and I will help you out. Have a great day.